Hi everybody, this is Pace Setter Mark here. Today I want to cover the the water service system prior to winter arriving and what we need to do is clean this clean this out and uh, not have an issue with you breaking the, the hose or the line when it freezes. So you need to find your water service which is this, it's typically a white panel, uh, MDF or Malamine panel with all your services on it. And the line you want to find is the one that leads out to the exterior of your home. In this case, we've traced it to this this line here, and if you were to follow this, it takes you out uh, outside. We're, we're going to go there and look at that valve as soon as we've closed this off. So what you want to do, this being your main water line down below here, uh, is shut this valve off completely. So now it's closed. There's a, there's a small uh, distribution uh, waste valve right above it. We're going to come back and, and deal with that as soon as we close off the line outside. But number one is turn this valve off. And then we're gonna go. Hi guys, now I'm outside here. We're looking at the, the valve service from the home. This is what we need to deal with. This is underground sprinkler. We don't have to touch this at this point. This uh, most often is not part of your house, but if it is, I often leave it open to allow the water to flow. But we wanna stop, we wanna drain this line. And uh, how you do that, you wanna take off the, uh, the one-way valve or vacuum breaker as they call it and uh, prevent the water from fracturing this if it sits in there. As you can see, there's a little bit of water in here. And I just want to, you know, dump that out. And then we proceed to drain this and just, just open it up and let whatever excess water out of there. It'll do this for a little bit. Once that slows down or stops, then we can go back inside and I'll show you how to drain the line that we originally uh, looked at. Hi guys, back again, Pace Hitter Mark here. We're in the basement, and we've turned off the we've turned this valve off, and we went outside and found the uh, exterior shot off valve, and we, we turned that. We took the uh, uh, vacuum breaker off, and uh, shook that out. So we drained it. Everything's good. Now we're back down here. So what we have to do is drain. There's a tiny little valve above uh, the shut off valve that we need to drain. So we have to drain the remaining water out of this line that's running to the exterior of the home and how you do that is you grab a bucket because you are also it's going to be all over the floor and turn this to the left and that'll loosen this out and the water will start dripping and hopefully it doesn't spray everywhere but we'll find out here shortly and just catch this water as it's making its way just like so And you want to continue with this until there's no more water out. And just leave the valve off and everything should be fine. Put this, put this little uh, uh, valve back in. Make sure you close it because uh, you could forget about it come springtime when you start it up. That's happened before and then you're all wet and messed up. So. This will take a few minutes. Okay guys, so this is now drained, and I don't know, there's probably a few cups of water in this bucket. So that gives you an idea what you're looking at. And I'm going to put the uh, discharge plug back in. And you should be okay after that. Make sure you finger tighten that, should be fine. Again, at least you know where it is and, and you're ready for next season. 